We're finally to the weekend and of course tomorrow being Valentine's Day. So let's take a look at your forecast for tomorrow. We're going to have plenty of sunshine. It's going to be warmer than today, getting up to 58. The breeze is going to pick up, so keep that in mind as you head out in the evening. It's going to make it feel pretty chilly and temperatures tomorrow night will eventually get well down back into the 30s. Let's check out the wind forecasting for tomorrow. It's going to start off pretty light. Winds around five miles per hour. As we head towards the middle of the afternoon, the wind's going to pick up and gust up to about 20 miles per hour. And those gusty breezes will continue into tomorrow evening. It's not going to be fierce wind, but it is going to be noticeable breezy out there. So I'll get to keep that in mind for your plans tomorrow night. Temperatures starting off tomorrow, at least down near freezing. Heading up in the afternoon, a quicker warmer than today in the upper 50s. And then tomorrow night, another round of cold air comes back in. It could be down as low as about 31 or 32 when we wake up Sunday morning. And then during the day Sunday, we're kind of like we were today. High temperatures back down into the 40s. So up and down temperatures continue. We've got more of that in the Storm Tracker 7 day, which I'll show you here in just a moment. What we don't have this weekend is precipitation. We are going to stay mostly clear as we head through your Saturday and for your Sunday. Now we will be tracking a system on Monday that will be spreading clouds into the area and eventually some rain will get in here as we get into Monday night and Tuesday. And yes, our temperatures will be plenty warm enough that by the time any precipitation arrives here in our area, it will just be in the form of rain. As far as your forecast on the water goes, we are still going to be kind of breezy throughout the weekend because of the temperature changes. So it's not going to be the best weekend for your boating plans, even though the seas themselves won't be that rough. It's just going to be kind of nasty breezy at times again with the temp different uh, temperature changes. I want to say a big hi right now to uh, Cubs Pack 26 from Wilmington Island. They came out tonight and visited our studio. Got to play on the weather wall and ask some good questions about the weather. So thank you for coming out. All right, let's take a look at your storm tracker seven day forecast. We are looking at that up and down temperature trend to continue. All these days are looking at temperatures below average or climate average highs above 60. We don't see that at all in the next seven days. We've got some days highs in the 40s, some days in the 50s. We've got rain on the way next Tuesday. Kevin and Jennifer are back to cold weather for the end of next week.